In a dark or threatening location, sometimes a great way to lure your character to your horror movie villain is to present them with a light spot or location disguising danger as safety. You could go even further and incorporate light as an element into your villain themselves. Oh, now I remember my little Teresita. Now I remember the little girl who was afraid of the dark. The film Leopard Man plays with this concept in one notable scene where a young girl Teresa is making her way home. She's paranoid of her surroundings and established as being afraid of the dark. When she has to pass back under a bridge, she chooses a path with light bouncing off the water therein. However, entering the tunnel and being lit up reveals her presence to a leopard, who then winds up killing her. In Psycho, Main character Marion is having trouble seeing as she drives down the road on a dark and stormy night. That's when she sees the light of the Bates Motel, a locale owned by psychopath Norman Bates who ultimately winds up killing her. In Halloween, when Laurie Strode enters her friend Annie's dark and seemingly empty house, she's drawn into the room where her friend's bodies are by a sliver of light shining around the doorway. I looked right into its deadlight. And I wanted to be there. Deadlights. In the It franchise, the Lovecraftian villain Pennywise lures children to their deaths by using deadlights within his body. This sort of technique is fairly easy to do during shooting as long as you have a light source. If you're going to make use of light to amplify your danger, I would recommend darkening the surrounding area to increase the contrast with the light source. <laughs> 